Well, hello there, everybody. Welcome to Chronic Pain Show 128. I'm, I'm in... Jess Awesome, your yeah. head announcer. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. And I'm Ivatopia. Used to be the head announcer. Should be head announcer, but okay. Here comes Ivan. Make his way to the ring. We're going to see what the matches are coming oh, up. Oh, and don't forget, Supernova TV is here. Yep, um, unhappy like normal because of what's happening. Like, go to the great. Well, hello there, and welcome to Ivatopia's Wrestling Domination. This is Chronic Pain Show 128. The game is Pro Wrestling X, currently in early access on Steam where you can buy it, as you can see from the link on the screen. Me, Ivatopia, and my wife, who's going to be helping out with this, have nothing to do with the game other than buying it and playing it and enjoying it. And I'd also like to add the opening music you can hear right now is from the title screen of the Pro Wrestling X game itself. Hope you enjoy the show. Okay, the opening match is Ivan Reva taking on the Fiend in a cage. The second match tonight is Von Kau taking on Dane. I'm going to get Dane tonight. And then the, and the final match of the night is The Claw taken on Overlord. And The Claw's the current number contender for the next pay-per-view, remember. Okay, Ivan's in a cage. Oh, did you hear about that as well? I believe we're going we're gonna to hear it later tonight. But before the show, Ivan did a pre-recorded uh, message to Tower and that. Mm. I think he may have mentioned you too. And Tower was supposed to reply. We came out here. I I'm not sure if he's replied yet. We're going to find out. He might be replying in the back and as we speak. I'm not sure. Because I'm head announcer, I got you a gift. What? Jelly beans! Okay, Eat thank one. you. Okay. It, Eat one! Mm mm, nice, yeah, mm, lovely. For reals! I don't want to one, it's probably gross! <laughs> That's the point! Mm, nice, yay! No, no, no. Oh, we have one of them horrible ones! <laughs> okay. I'm the head announcer, so you have to do what I say. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're climbing! Been climbing. Oh, I haven't getting back in. Okay, I need to swallow this thing. Whoa, he's only flying! <laughs> Is it that bad? Mm. Dipping over Dippy. Are you, aren't you saying a word? Can I talk? I mean, half the time I'm forbidden to talk. And then you're still in your brown panties, thanks mm -hmm. to Jess as well, it seems. Oh, I'm just flying! I'm just flying! Would you like another one? I'm fine, thank you. Super Tiffy can have one. No, I'm good. Take one, Supernova Tiffy. Fine. Thanks, Ivatopia. I hope you get a nice one. What'd you get? I don't know, but it was a bit here. Yeah. Okay, Ivan's hitting him. He's whipping the fiend. He's got oh he's going for his pattern line salt, moon salt, as he's running back. Oh that pre recorded thing we said what what happened earlier today. Well it's pre recorded now for us. Can we skip it? I'm the head announcer so Well I believe uh, my sources said it involved you, I believe. In Tower, let's see what he had to say. We always have to listen to Ivan Reaver. Why wouldn't we? No it. skipping. Here he is! Tonight I'm going to take the Fiend on. And the thing is, I want to do a stipulation if you agree to it, Tower. Because personally, I think it's so disrespectful and disgusting what you and Jess are doing to this company. And unfortunately, technically there's nothing I can do about it until two months from now when I beat you after going through this little tournament of yours and get the company back. But until then, you still need to basically be reined in. So what I suggest tonight is quite simple. If I beat the Fiend tonight, then Tower and Jess, for one week, you have to do exactly as I say. That's right. As long as it doesn't affect your wrestling players, you have to do as I say. So that means if I tell you to shush, Jess, while you're at the announce table, you've got to shush. Anything I say. But if I lose, then I'm yours for a whole week. To do whatever you two will say or want. As long as it doesn't affect my wrestling career, okay? Do we have a deal? Wow, so that's... I'm intrigued. So that's what he said. Well, did, uh, my, my thing is, did Tower accept? Like, as far as I knew, when we came out live, he hadn't, he hadn't accepted yet, but he might, I'm assuming he would do it during this match. And since Jesse didn't even know anything about this... I'm going to go back in the back and talk to him about it real quick. Well, like I said, I believe he's supposed to be coming up in a minute, so it's probably best staying out here and finding out. But it's something we should discuss, because it doesn't just affect Yeah, but you're the head announcer, so you need to stay out here, really. Oh, oh, Fiend, if he's going to climb out, it won't matter. If he wins it, this is a place we've never said. The Fiend is never going to win that easily. Oh, he's in the back of his I head. He's never going to let him. Wow. Yeah, he's going to win it now. Come on, Ivan, climb. Fiend, get up. We, we, we kind of need it to tower to confirm Ivan's stipulations first, though, don't we? Do we? Well, yeah, because if you didn't confirm it and Ivan wins, it means nothing. Oh. So we need to, we literally, for once, we need to listen to Tower. I don't like Nick talking to him. Normally we need him to come out or at least speak. We or something. always need Tower. Oh, we got a pen, we got a pen. What do you mean? Two, three. Ugh, oh, so close, so close, so close. Yeah, tonight we really need him. We always need him. But I mean, we really, really, really need him. He's tonight. our owner. 
Mm-hmm. Owner, commissioner of here and aces. So... Oh, what a kick to the face! Beautiful drop kick. act like we don't need him. I'm just saying we really, Without really him, need him tonight. you wouldn't have a job as second in command. Well, before he was the owner, I was head of command. Mm, but you and got And I got demoted. paid more, too. Now I've been demoted. I get less pay. It's not fair. <laughs> All thanks to me. I know. Put yourself oh. on the back there, aren't you, Jess? Oh, of course I am. Because I'm fabulous. No, I'm sorry. I'm awesome. Oh, we get power on to Ivan now? Ow. So one part, I really want this match to go longer so Tower actually accepts, but we're going to have to find out. Oh. Fiend's got a few wins and we haven't got any word from Tower yet. Really? The Fiend is going to climb when he's right there. Well, he did powerbomb him. And he has he's got blood. He's right there. He has, he's got blood in his eye, too. Look at his face. Oh! And oh, I just heard in the back that Tower's made his decision and he's going to be coming up shortly. Oh, okay. We're going to hear it. Cool. Yay! If I haven't up first, though. He's not going to climb up first. The Fiend is going to win anyway. Oh, oh, he's, oh he's like a little in time. Told ya. Ah, he was close though. Oh, and he hit the cage. And here's Tower. <laughs> Still trying to do deals, I see. When you're not in no position to. But I was shaming you on the one condition. And you I'd accept all the clients end off. Very simple. If you win tonight, Jess will be yours for one week to do what you want, not me, her. Huh. It's better than nothing, right? If the fiend wins to have a hand, you are my Jess's servant for one whole week, just as you said. And you know what to sweeten the deal even more? As a good offering on your part, no matter what happens, I want you to agree to your terms for one day, you under me and Jess. No matter what, just by agreeing to this little arrangement of ours. Otherwise, there's no deal to what you say. Redemption. Wow. <laughs> so he's basically agreed by changing it, but we now need Iron to agree in that. And I'm getting word that yeah, that, that what you Jess, you thought that was live, but that was actually said early before the match. He actually had sent that directly to Ivan. And then I believe Ivan replied before this match. Yeah, that's, that's what he's saying that happened. He, they sent it directly. He sent that message directly out. That's why he hadn't received it. So that's why he thought it was live because Tao didn't let anyone else know about it. He should have let me know. I believe it was not long before this match started, and obviously we all had to come out here. We're sitting down here, and and that's when Ivan yeah, has replied yeah. to him. So I think that's why. So it wasn't live, even though that's the first any of us are hearing of it. Oh, I'm getting pinned. Two, three. So the stipulation might be active right now, or it might not. It depends if Ivan agreed. I believe he spoke to him before. The, uh, so Ivan's all mine for a day if he agrees, regardless of if he wins or loses. Apparently, but That's if gonna be fun. but if he wins, you're his for a week. But then he's still mine for a day. Yeah, basically. So for eight days, you got uh, theoretically. <laughs> he's under you. You're under him. But he's just under Tower. So if Tower wants to do stuff, oh, take down. Well, oh, I believe you better win. I believe we have Ivan's the... in the back with his reply. It's my show. Stop. I hear the fact that I still have no choice with these, but fine. I accept your terms. The one day under your control will be worth it to have seven days of keeping her away from Supernova Tiffy and the rest of this roster. Wow. Oh my gosh. I just thought of something. What? So The you said... reason why he wants to is because he wants me all to himself. I don't think so. The tower kind of <laughs> changed it. He had to agree to it if he wanted it at all. But think about it. Why have me under his control? Well, well the original stipulation was you and, there was and an Tower. There's an RKO out of nowhere from the Fiend. Yeah, but the original stipulation, what Ivan said was you... Oh, no, that was Ivatopia, wasn't it? Or Ivan. Yeah, yeah I'm Ivatopia. The original stipulation, like, as, like you saw sleeping Sleeping of Tiffy, and you agree, don't you, was for Tower and Jess. Tower basically said he agrees as long as it's only Jess, and he asked that to do the extra day. So he wasn't aiming just for you. He was aiming for you and Tower. But what you say to Miltif, don't you agree? I do agree. And honey, I don't think he's going to be wanting to do what you want him to do. Oh, a body slam there? Is that his? Oh, she wrote. Is Ivan going to have you Come for some on, days? Come on, Fiend, get up. I want Ivan under my control. I don't want to be under his stinky control. He's climbing, he's climbing. Go, Ivan, go! 
Go, go! Yes! He's got his leg up. He won. Oh, yeah, he's not, he's not down. He's got both. He got just four, remember? We've seen stuff like this in the Fiend. past. Stop. Stop running. Just climb. I think he's trying to grab him. Oh, no, idiot. Give me. Yeah, I only won. So you only show for seven days, but he has to be on just for a day. What's your thoughts on that supernova Tiffy, by the way? Hey. One day with her is a breeze compared to seven. We got to match replays. This is early on in the match. See that? Wow. Mid air, the fiend uh, face first at the cage. This was this was uh, uh, dangerous. I even got his arm up just before he wasted because he snapped his neck. I mean, we saved himself there. See this movie did look a beautiful rolling clothesline takes him down, and let me see a beautiful drop kick that Where cut the fiend open. Was split open. Yeah, and that's when he tried to climb here. It got knocked off because he had the blood in his eyes. He did that stipulation because he knew he could beat the fiend. Well, well yeah, because he wanted to win. <laughs> And the Fiend had his chance. The Fiend could have won. The Fiend sucks. And this was, was this the end bit with the body yes. slam? This is where the, the glory uh, Ivan climbing gets out. So, is this a sign in two months' time? Will Ivan be in the final with the tower <laughs> beating him and basically being our bosses? If that means yeah. yours, Jess. What do you, what's your thoughts, Jess? And you two should know Tiffy quick. I'm good because you know what? Tower and I have been talking about me having an ironclad contract. So even if somebody was to take over control, I would still be head announcer. Well, it won't, well, it won't work at that point. Yes, it would. This is whoever's in charge. Oh, wrong count, wrong count. I'd have one like Supernova Tiffy and I. Well, hers is online, and so is, and that's uh, basically Tower stuff. I believe she's coming to the back in a second. His is also uh, everything that he says like this. Here's uh, Tower. Well done, well done, Ivan Reaver, it seems. Jess is under you for a whole week. But unfortunately, remember the deal, that starts tomorrow. So we'll at the end next show. Meaning tonight, for the next 24 hours, that is. You gotta listen to whatever I say or Jess says, as long as it'll affect your career. Anything goes. <laughs> Redemption. Wow! So I was under control tonight into basically tomorrow and tower, and then from that day after. So basically, this time tomorrow, it's what drops over under his control. And if I'm not mistaken, seven days from now will lead us into next week's show. So next week's show, theoretically, you have to do what Ivan says. So that means I'm assuming you won't be able to torment uh, Supernova Tiffy or me that show. Yes. Wow. My, how the tides have turned. Wow. Oh, low blow by Von Count. What's your thoughts on that, Jess, then? <laughs> it's only for a few, for a week. Besides, he'll probably enjoy my company over hers any day. Hmm. <laughs> you wish. Power bomb there. Close line to the face of Bane, people. Oh, please. I'm going to make sure that I'm staying here with or without Tower being the head person and the owner. Oh, this is the first time I ever heard you doubt Tower's going to win. You never oh, doubted him before. I don't him. doubt it. That, that, sound, that sounded like a doubt to me, didn't it, Sir Novativi? It sure did. Oh, we got a whip. Got him by the head. This is Tower a very... beat him already, so why can't he do it again? Because he's basically been tormenting Ivan at that point, and... So, I'm gonna stay. Oh, going to listen to Dane, pre-recorded in the back, and Dane's getting destroyed Will you stop trying to take over my show? I'm the head announcer now, not you. It's Dane. Learn your place. Tonight, the night, Canadian royalty will prove why I am so good. I would beat down Von Counts because you're nothing but a peasant in my way because I am Dane. Remember that and make sure you bow to me after you get back on your feet after I destroyed you so much. Ha! <laughs> you need to learn your place. I'm just trying to get the show flowing and they, 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 Dane, he wants Von Count to bow to him after this match. After he beats him but so far over in that arm drag we've seen a lot more aggressive Von Count than we used to. Oh, body it's slam. probably because Von Count has more to lose than Dane. Well, Dane's got more to gain. He's, he's Other than one title shot he's really had, he's not really done much for his crew since he's been yeah, here. Yeah, and how would it be if Von Count lose to Dane? 
Yeah, and like we know, Von Kahn was upset that he wasn't included. Oh, low blow in Carnage 3. And that's what's been the biggest beat up his bonnet ever since then. And that's why he's taking it and he's upset that the claw is basically the one contender. And mm. he, in his eyes, he should have been at Carnage 3. He main invented Carnage 1. He was part of the co main event for Carnage 2. And then he wasn't even at Carnage 3. And that's where he's upset. Where the star uh, basically was almost there. And the claw, of course, was. And besides. I have a topia. You'd miss me if I wasn't here, wouldn't you? Being the head announcer and all. Yeah, yeah, of course, yeah. Okay. Okay, yeah. You miss me a lot. Yes, yeah, of course. Okay, back to the match. Okay, we're back. My time with Ivan starts now, right? Powerbomb. Well, that's what Tower stated, yeah. Basically, into, well, what was it, about five, ten minutes ago to this time tomorrow? Well, five, ten minutes ago, time tomorrow. Oh, Ivan Reaver! Would you mind terribly coming out here today? What? Do we announce it with us? Now? I'm getting word someone's giving him the message in the back. So I guess he'll, he'll make his way out there because he has to. Oh, why he's doing that? We can see this Just match, a though. suggestion? Or is it? I just got word that he's saying if it's a suggestion, he's, he's going to just stay at the back. Okay, fine. It's not a suggestion. It's a command. Get your butt out here. Uh, okay, uh, uh, he said he's, he's basically coming out. We'll, we'll get to that in a second. Oh, power bomb! Back of the head, on the steel. What do you think she's gonna do? I, I don't know. Ugh, this can only end in tragedy. Yeah, and unfortunately, he can't do anything about. It. As long as it doesn't physically affect his career. Oh, Bryce the better coming out. It's like a train wreck you just can't look away from. Yeah, as long as it doesn't affect his career, there's nothing he can do about it. That's the only thing she can't physically do, isn't it? There's only thing she can do that'll hurt him just as bad. Yeah, but I mean physically affect his career. Like she can't tell him to come um, out and quit I'm or right something. I'm right here, you two. I can hear you. I was just. To yeah. Bryce yeah, the match. Look, look, And who do we have coming up in the back? Oh, I believe it's a pre-recorded message of Von Count. Oh, and I see Ivan's coming through the crowd, so I guess... Hi! Ivan, mean, take a seat as we listen to this. There's only one thing in this business that you count on, and that is me tonight. Decimating, destroying, breaking in two, dang, Canadian road to... Pff, you're enough of an obstacle in my way back to the top. Remember that. Okay, take a seat back. right here next to me and Ivatopia, not next to Supernova Tiffy. He's coming over here now. And we're back, and I believe Bryce, I thought, was coming out to help Dane, but I think they're kind of falling out of each other. Um, when did that happen? During Von Count's uh, pre recorded message. Mm. I think they cut the wrong person or whatever. So it looks like they are. Yep, yeah, powerbomb. So, Ivan, uh, okay, you, you, you're here. Uh, put, you, put your mic on, put your mic on. Yeah, yeah I'm getting it situated. You know, I just wrestled, I was about to leave. Why? And miss all this fun and excitement. Yeah. Okay. So since I'm out here to announce... Oh, what a kick, people! Don't act too enthused. What, for the kick? No, to be out here with me. Well, like I said, I could sit near Super Nautilus. At least you can see, like... It's just, you're looking nice, Super Nautilus, not normal. Thanks! You're welcome. Ha! Oh, well. Can I have your jacket? It's cold. Well, no, he it... can't give you his jacket. Well, why can't I? Because I said so. Fine. Sorry to be on too fame, not allowed. Oh, striker! Just why do you have to be so rude? Yeah. I'm not. I come to show up with my tag team partner in Aces, unfortunately. Isn't he fabulous? Lee awesome. <laughs> Who? I mean, awful. Who's fabulously awesome? Me or striker? Striker's fabulously awful. Oh, of oh, oh. I kind of got rid of you a little bit with that because I don't want to get on with him, but. He's helped me keep the tag titles in general. You're so much better than he is. Mm, of course I am. Well, that's why I trained him. So if you win, you'll keep me on. Hmm? Oh, we're getting. Uh, uh, and here's Tower well, coming up in that. the back. Yeah, how, how we see Tiffy? I wonder what Tower's gonna say. And I'm sorry, nobody was listening to you. They were too busy listening to the head announcer, me. Okay. Ivan, I just realized tonight. After the show, this place is actually going to be hosting its very own food drive. And it's going to go on for a long time. Basically, by tomorrow morning, they're going to have a lot of wasted stuff to get rid of. Don't care where you are, but you're going to be back here in this building tomorrow morning. I think it's 4 a.m., 6 a.m., something like that. And you're going to have to 
alone remove all the rubbish and clean this whole arena of redemption. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> i got to be back here at 6 a.m. in the morning to clean all the rubbish. This arena is huge for having it here. Oh, wow. Ooh, take off your shirt. Well, I can't actually do that. I want a jacket. Well, take it all off. Seriously? Oh, get a pen. Yes, seriously. It's not a suggestion this time. <sighs> kidding me. Nope. Got a pen attempt here, it seems. Two. Two. Oh. What's Striker doing? Trying to leave, apparently. Like, he's a little scared coward. I don't think he was leaving. I think he was having a conversation with someone in the crowd. And now for your next order. Turn and face me. Why? Power bomb to Dane. We're getting a, we're getting a pin attempt. One, two. two. So close. <sighs> Yet so far away. What's just uh, Super Tiffy doing with Ivan? Oh, we're going to the back, Douglas and Bryce. Let's see what he has to say. Let's go to him now. Here he is. I went for hell and back last pay per view. I almost had my career ended. Yet I'm out here trying to help you, Dane. Trying to. <sighs> And what do you do? You slap me back in the face. You don't slap me, you hit me, you attack me. Same with you, Von Count. You know, I'm just sick and tired with everybody in this company. I'm just sick and tired of basically everything. Everyone's always after Bryce. Everyone's always after the best. You know why? Because you're jealous. Because you're not as good as me. That's why you won't get on my back. I'm going to start throwing you on my back and proving for once for a while I truly am the best. You mark my words, it's going to happen. It will happen. And how many championships has Bryce the best won? Uh, the world title. I believe it once. So how is he the best when there's other people in this company that have won it more than he has? He wants to prove that, obviously. Okay. Well, obviously he's not. You look at these two. Oh, okay. come on, again. So as I was saying, our next order of business, aka what you're going to do is kiss me. What do you mean? In front of Supernova TV. Whoa, so Tiffy, what do you feel about that? She wants time to kiss her. Supernova Tiffy. Okay, she's not actually just staring daggers. We're getting a pin attempt, and Ivan does not look very happy about this. Oh, and I want you to kiss me like you kiss her. Seriously? I'm... This is yes. not right. You're going to body slam. Mm. Mm. <laughs> there. Ow! She pulled my hair! How can I pull your hair when I'm all the way over here? I agree with that, definitely, definitely. Don't you agree with that, Ivatopia? No, I saw her hat. I, I, oh, for crying out loud. Ivatopia, you know the thing you had, the conversation you had the other week with Griffin, yeah? Oh, oh, yeah, 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 she was already there. I got you. Oh, my God. Listen, listen, God Ivatopia's quicker. an idiot. I'm not an idiot. I got, I agreed this time. Leave me alone. <laughs> okay, back to the match. we got a body slam here by Von Count. So where are you going to take me to dinner tonight, Ivan? I wasn't planning to take you to dinner. Um, yeah you are. Whatever you want then. Remember, I have to be back here by 6 a.m. now. Well that's, that's okay, timeless. we've got the whole night. Pin, Up pin! Until 6 a.m. You are? We have until 6 a.m. to do what we want before you have to be back. Von Count has won the match. She's been very aggressive of late. I told you Von Count was going to win. Well, we got the match replays now it seems. Oh, cool. Look at, look at this. Let's, we're getting a, 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 a ring out, but it's a back break. That was awesome. We got Bryce, the best, came out. It kind of got a little tense with him and Dane, it seemed. Bryce early was talking about how he wanted to, to change and be better and prove he is the best. And he got a little, little blow there. See, look, Dane was basically, no, get away. Where the fallout was. You got any things to add, uh, Ivan, to this? Not really. That he thinks I'm cute and sexy and adorable i said not really say it thank you like you mean it like uh, you're talking to supernova tiffy thank you cute sexy and adorable no, don't get you supernova tiffy okay what was that last bit what that's supernova tiffy give you an old out of that side okay i'll carry on three and that's where bond count one yeah it seems his new attitude is very aggressive and it's get picking wins up Okay, and we're... here's our last one, the Claw and Overlord. The only Tender and Overlord going at it. Now, if Overlord wins, does that mean he gets the number one contender spot? Listen, as I know, it's not on the line, so no. That's close. It will obviously 
if Tao allows it, should put him in the contendership to get a shot down the line and at some point. in the back, we have the really, really awful striker. The showstopper is known as. Not. Even though Ivan may be my tag partner and aces, we may be tag champs together, I don't agree with him very often, but the stuff he said about you earlier, you are disgusting and that. Do what you did last week at uh, basically to, yes, we may be split up, but she's supposed to be with you at the moment. She's supposed to be your girlfriend. What you did to her, just to get at me, you are disgusting. And that's why I went out there, really. that's why I tried to struck this show, to basically show you I am not down and out. I can still keep fighting. As long as there's a heart pumping in this body, I will still keep fighting. And as for you, Jess, you're just as bad as him. If anything, you're slightly worse. For the simple reason, you're delusional. That I think you are basically the most good-looking, sexiest woman in the planet. That's farthest. I mean, farthest, farthest from the truth. You're like the other end of the spectrum compared to any of the people on this roster or Aces roster. You are basically... Delusional. Wow! You think I'm delusional? Wow, that's what Striker stated. Striker, I suggest you get out here before you lose your job. Wow! Wow, I don't believe Striker said that. You have five seconds. Wow. Or you're fired. I'm, get, I'm getting word. After he said it, he literally walked out. Then yeah, I, I believe that means you're fired. I, will, I believe you literally walked out. I believe he didn't hear what you said. I'm getting word from oh, oh, Tower sending a word to me too. Tower is saying Jess not to fire him yet. He basically he, he he needs him here still. But his time will come and redemption will come. He's saying basically when he wins everything in two months time. Wow. Oh oh yeah oh yeah and he's also give oh I have to tell you this in a minute because we're going to overload first pre-recorded. I'm so excited. I am going to blunt some claws tonight, I lord it over you. Basically the main reason he needs him because they've signed a contract to be uh, at the pay-per-view too. It's already been signed, uh, like where Ivan's going to compete in. He's in another match, so he can't be fired unless he loses that, 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 that thing at pay-per-view basically. That's why he's saying you can't fire him. If he loses that, then he's free to be fired because he can't win the company or anything then. But, so, but because of this signing that Tower's done, wow. Okay. Oh, the claws going at it with, with um, Overlord. Back and forth. Uh, Super Nova Tiffy. I've, oh, we got a count out. I was going to ask both of you quickly. Eight. What's your thoughts on um, Jess trying to fight um, Strike and the announcement that he's going to be in a match? And it basically, so he could advance too, so I'm assuming the following pay-per-view, it'll be him and Ivan, if Ivan wins, say, and say Striker wins, before they face Tower. What's your thoughts on that? I think somebody will come alongside of the bed this morning. What's yours, Ivan? <laughs> well, if, 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 if he goes through, I beat him anyway, it doesn't matter. Who we have in the back? Claw. Are you apologized for me last week? Why did you do- The star is bright. The star is right. You do not open the big fat mouth tonight. What the- Calm down, I thought we are Glostar. We work together, we're in synchronization. What I say, you think, what you think, I say, and we're always in one. The star says the mouth needs shut, you need to arrange your match victory that will be yours tonight when you engage your brain and keep it shut. The star says right. So what you're saying is, don't buy mouth yes again. Shh, zip it, zip it, shut the mouth. The star says zip it, shut it, zip the mouth. But if I have my mouth, how can he eat? I'm getting hungry now, you know. You only starve out there in the ring. Starve in front of everybody. Is that what you want? Is that what you want? You want the claw to starve in front of everybody out there? <sighs> the star says you may open mouth to engage in chewing. Here's your beef bologna sandwich. Beef? Bologna? Oh, that's extra. Let me see what this tastes like. Let me give it a... Oh, that's good. So we know the claw is full for this match, apparently. Uh, what do you think, Ivan? He really likes to eat. I agree with Ivan, I agree! The claw is just as stupid as Ivatopia. They ain't stupid! Ivatopia, do you get my last cheesecake? Oh, it's gorgeous! I love that cheesecake! It was strawberry again, thank you very much! Yeah, I'll just leave it there. Leave what there? Not You'll have me another cheesecake! Where is it? Where is it? Ivatopia, just concentrate in the match. You can have cheesecake later. Oh, okay, great, can't wait. Ivan, I need you to compliment me and tell me that I'm pretty right after we listen to Tower in the back. Here he is. Do I have to? Yes. Oh, Ivan, about 12, 2-ish tomorrow, while you're still under our control. You know this ring. 
is going to basically be put to the side. You need to come back to this building if you're still not here cleaning up, that is. <laughs> and you're going to have to move the whole ring to our next arena for next week on your own. I know we normally have uh, a couple of guys, you know, about five or ten people who do this. You're doing it on your own. And you will have to make sure, as part of the deal, is have it set up on your own by next week. And yes, your 24 hours may be over, but if this ain't set up, there's no show. And I'm ordering no one else to help you, so... If you don't want no IWD, no chronic pain, don't set it up. And it's on you. <laughs> Redemption. No fair, he's gonna take you away from me. I need you to help me with my laundry, my delicates, folding... Putting my clothes away, doing Do you even have any delicates left? Because they also get thrown into the crowd. Yes. Okay, if you say so. Now, back to what I asked you before. I want you to tell me what you think of me, and I want you to be honest. Truly honest? Remember, she said honest. Yes, truly honest, meaning I want you to know. I want to know what you think. Honestly. Okay, honestly. Honest. Yeah, honestly, I honestly. believe that the sexiest woman in the world is the one sitting next behind you. To be I said with. honestly, I'm don't being honest. lie. I'm being honest. Yeah, and you're lying. I'm not lying. You're lying. So what you're saying is you want me to do the opposite of honest. Be oh, honest. Okay, okay, so opposite honest. Uh, I think Supernova Tiffy is the worst woman in the world and you're the best there. And she's ugly, right? I Again, I'm being it. opposite of honest, so yeah, Supernova Tiffy is ugly compared to you. It's not the opposite of honest. You're being honest. Right? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm doing whatever, whatever you want me to say. I'm telling the truth. If that's what you want. We've got sharp shooting over, look, tap out, it's tell all over. Tell the truth. Who do you think is prettier? Again, if you want me to tell the truth, super yes. tiffy. I said honest. So you don't Why want... do you keep lying? So, in a word, what she's getting at, you want me to say the opposite, so, okay, you. Yeah, better. You're really bad at that, Ivan. No, you, you tell me to be honest, and I've got to do as you say. So basically, you basically want to say what you want to hear should be saying, and then I can answer you. Ivan, what she wants you to do is to lie to her. So, man, honestly, the claw <laughs> won. Yay, claw! Boo, claw! Why? Claw won. That's good. No, it's not. That ninkin poop. Oh yeah, because. Uh, he said a few things about you, Jess. I get that it. That obviously aren't true, correct, Ivan? Okay, I must have noticed what she said over there a minute ago, so now of course they're not true. Yeah. Okay, this is a beautiful shop shoot. I was told me, what do you think? Oh, and if uh, you want, there's some cheesecake in my room. Oh, cheesecake! Oh, yeah, yeah. And it's strawberry, yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. I think you it well there, but I don't. I guess I have to agree. I don't agree what he said about you. Oh, what's that? In the ring! The claw's bleeding! Von Count! <laughs> Yay! What's he doing? I can always count on Von Count to get the job done that you Ninkin Poops can't. That's a cheap shot by Von Count there. Oh, it wasn't. It was an awesome shot. I can't be hitting him again and out. Again again. Oh, and again. Oh, the star's coming out. Is he going to make the save? Ugh. So he's gonna make the save here, or we get the power bomb. The star's smart about what he says. Oh, he, he's making a run for it. Von Count's going can... for the crowd. And with that, we're gonna end the episode. I've been Ivan Reaver, unfortunately, without here. Uh, well, next and I've be been Jess Awesome, your head awesome announcer. I'm the former head announcer. I'm having dope, yeah. Who is not the head announcer anymore? That's why I said former, but hopefully it'll be one day. And we have some little tippy over there. Yeah. Hi. Like, subscribe, and, Bye, guys. and tune in next week. Bye, everyone. Have a great day. Bye.